been a while since I did a chicken update. I just put some more uh, oyster shell out here for them, and they were over there just now pecking at it. Good fresh water. I got, let me see, this girl, this bright yellow girl. That black copper moran, that black copper moran, and that Australorp chicken recently uh, from a friend of mine that she had bought a bunch of chicks at at, a, at Atwoods. I don't know if you've got that around here. This uh, we don't have an Atwoods right here, but there is one up where she lives. Anyway, hey Booster, we uh, she had too many, so. Uh, she wanted to give me some. And I traded her some peach pie filling and canned peaches for them. <laughs> so, yeah. I thought that was a pretty sweet deal. I also took some uh, purple hull pea seed up to her and some of the uh, yard-long bean seed that I had saved. We didn't plant any of those this year. i got to get in there and clean the chicken yard out just get a rake and rake that stuff out but anyway didn't plant yard longs this year because I still had a lot of jars of them left apparently we don't eat as many green beans as I thought we did uh, if the other green beans that I planted come up well, I'll just use those for fresh eating anyhow see they're pecking around they peck around in the in the oyster shell get what they need Plenty of calcium that way. They've been laying eggs. We've been getting four or five a day. I know it don't seem like a lot out of this many birds, but this old girl, she's probably five or six years old. I don't even know. She might lay once a week. And that brown one, she might be back laying again. She's about five or six years old, too. But she don't lay a lot. Hey, girl. In fact, I'd almost given up on her. But I think she's laying now. The other birds, like that Orpington. Mine, mine looks so raggedy right now. They're starting to mold a little. But anyway, like that Orpington and the other, the other birds I was talking about that were given to me are from this past spring. So they're only about five months old. But I think that Maybe one of one of the black copper rands is laying, I believe. I'm getting dark brown eggs. Not those chocolatey ones like we show in pictures, but I'm getting them. And that big big boy, I raised him from a baby chick. I actually got him with a bunch of chickens that were supposed to all be roosters. And he indeed was. It was just for meat, you know. And then the the... Rhode Island Red and the little black Orpington that I had before that died during the heat, they were from that same bunch, and it turned out they were hens. We had other hens out of that, too, when we lived over at the other place, but they were out in the hawks got them. Stop taking it, her. So there you go. As a chicken update. We're getting eggs now. Stop picking. Anyway, we're getting eggs again. And since we have some young birds, we should be good for quite a while. And hopefully, at some point, I can expand this pen out that way. Put a cover over it, just like I've got here. Keep hawks and stuff out. Keep the birds in. And then uh, maybe even add more. It's possible I might let somebody set. Sometimes that little white bird, she's a real good little mama. Uh, I mean, she's just mixed breed, I guess. But uh, she's a real good mama bird. So I might let her set some eggs at some point if she gets in the mood, the broody mood. All right, there you go. An update on the chickens. Okay, it's early, but we got, we've got two eggs already, so I'm going to go ahead and get them and uh, take them in. They're not huge. This one's